Hello, this is Linda Carruthers. Uh, I had to go to the doctor this morning, so while I was there, I stopped at the Hobby Lobby in Mobile. It's the first time I got to go there since they opened back up after the lockdown or whatever you want to call it. Anyway, I want to show you what I got. Uh, they had their Prima papers in the paper studio. Uh, on sale for 50% off. So this is Prima paper here. This is the Prima papers. And this is Golden Coast. And I don't know what the uh, other word is. Is the name of this paper. Can you see it? And there's Golden Coast. And there's 24 sheets. Um, it's 12 by 12. It's six double-sided designs and uh, four sheets of each. And, of course, this is made in China. But what I like is, see over here on this side? These can be cut out and made into tags. These are a sample of all the different papers. We'll go through this quickly, I hope. Anyway, these are some tags. First one is the tags. See? Uh, it's the seashore. There's the summer holiday. There's a crab. It says the golden coast up here with the pelicans. I'm sorry. There's some seaweed. There we go. Uh, beaching until further notice. There's the houses. There's some maps on here. It's pink shade. This is all done in shades of pink and uh, blues and a little bit of gray. And then there's some uh, paradise found. Find me under the palm tree or the palms. And then this one says you have to have your essentials. There's uh, sunglasses, bananas. I guess that's supposed to be a swimsuit top. Because uh, I don't know what else that is. Oh, it might be the, uh, the bag you wear for your uh, ID and stuff that you wear around your waist. Uh, there's a pineapple, there's an orange, and there's a, I think that's a headband. If not, that's the top of the swimsuit and that's the bottom. I don't know. I hope not. And then it says dream right here. Okay. That one. And then that's, uh, and then it's two-sided. So, this is the other side, and the other side is done in pink roses and pink crabs and uh, seashells. I just think that it's so pretty. Now, these are 12 by 12 pages, and I think she it said there was four sheets of each. Okay, so that's four right there. The next page is there's a seahorse. And there's a map, there's seaweed, there's some pink roses, there's the dream sign, there's the crab here, there's the air mall, air mail, I'm sorry, there's the stores, and there's a little tag right here with some writing on it, there's another tag right here, there's a map, there's a seashell, there's another map, different type of map. There's some roses with a seashell down here, and there's the life preserver right there. Okay, now on this one, I, I don't know that you can see it because, y'all, they bark at every little old thing. Anyway, but that's a map. It's a big map. It is like. But I think you can take this one. It's done in, uh, 
I want to say seafoam green and pink. Oh, excuse. Oh, excuse me. <clears throat> anyway, I think you can darken this up by using like antiquing paint or or your uh, ink. Oh, excuse me. Or your paint or your um, ink that you have. Anyway, so that's one, two, three, oh, well, if I can get it, four. Now, this is the third one, and this is seashells, like this is seashells, there's pink roses, there's uh, seahorses, right here and then there's another different type of seashell and that's what's all over here on that page it's all this is smaller size so you could fussy cut them or you could uh, put them as backgrounds or whatever and then on the back you have your sailboats and they're done in blue and pink that's done in blue and pink you're all your different sailboats that's what that is. Okay, so now you have four sheets of this. So that's one, two, three, four. Now this, I think, is number four. And on this one you have the uh, closed window. You have a, you have a hot air balloon with some roses, and then uh, some writing here. You have a hot air balloon right here. Now this one is done in yellow and gold here, but this hot air balloon is done in pink, blue, and white. And it's got roses there. And you got a, a seashore right here, outline, and you got another map. You got uh, Grand Hotel St. James right here. It's got the world map over it, done in gold. Then you got your seahorses and your seaweed, and I guess this is the outline of the of the ocean. Of the landmark, and then it says, um, um, album here, something or another. It's uh, some writing down there. I don't know what you can see it. I'm hoping you can see all of that. Some of it's really light. But like I said, you can take it. If you want to antique it, you can antique it. Now, on the back of this, you got stripes. And you got a map. It's lightened. And then you got blue and pink and blue and pink and blue and pink. Stripes on there. I don't know why they thought that would be pretty, but hey, to each their own. So there's four of these. Two, three, four. Now, this should be number five. And it is a map done in pink and yellow and gold and whatever. And it says special handling right here. You got a seashell there. You got roses there. And then you got some writing here done in gold. And then over on this side, you have the seashell with the rose you have a seahorse and a seashell and down here at the bottom this is air mail and you got another rose right there and on the back of this oh that's pretty i like green and this is dark green this is shades of green with roses pink roses and the background is pink 
and I thought that's cute. Well, now there's four pages of that. That's one, two, three, four. Now, this is the last page. This is number six. And these are your your cards or your tags or whatever you want to call them. And uh, we'll say the salty but sweet right here. I don't know if you can see that or not. Find me at the beach. And there's a map with that written in gold. Island vibes. And that's green palms. There's a gold heart. And then relax here with your chairs and your sandy beach. I'm sorry. And then down here you have your palm trees. You have your green leaves. You have your pineapple sat, satin out there sunning with a pink background with his eyeglasses on. Then you have I Find Paradise with You. And it's a pink map with that written in white. And the writing's done in gold. And then over here. You have the beach, it says, Oh, hi, paradise. And you got the blue sky, the pink beach, and then the white sand down here. You got the sailboats here. You got uh, good vibes, good tides. That's what that one says right here. I don't know if you can see that. It's written in gold, but it's on blue and green and pink down here. And then the feeling golden here. Alright, now this is number six. And on the back of it, you have this uh, creamy white background. And you have pink roses with green leaves. And you have four sheets of this. You got one, two, three, Four, sorry, and then you have your back sheet, which is good cardstock, right there. All right, now this was it was 19.99, right up here, but it was 50% off, which made it about ten dollars. Okay, now this one I got, and I got this other one. I couldn't afford too much. Now, I love this one. Alright. This one was $21.99. It was 50% off. But that's not what amazes me. This is the Paper Studio. And it's uh, Theodosius Square. I don't know if I said that right. But anyway, there it is. There's 60 designs. There's three of each. There's 180 pages in here. Sheets. 180 sheets. We won't go through all of them, but I wanted to show you some of them. Oh, I thought I cut. I thought I did. I'm sorry, y'all. I thought I, I thought I opened the map up, and I didn't. Hold on, be patient with me, I'll get it. I'm sorry, I thought I had it all done. Now, what is this side? I would use a knife or something, but I don't have anything nearby. So... Bear with me, I'll get it off of that. Mm. Mm. You don't want it opened up anytime soon, do they? Mm. 
Okay, so we're just going to go through this quickly. I hope you can see. This is dark brown. It's a uh, antique looking. It's got papers on it. It's got flowers and leaves and stuff written on it, handwriting. One. It's just one sided sheet, y'all. There's two. Okay, this is dark brown with writing on it. And I'm sorry, but I'm showing them sideways. Three, there's, yeah, there's three sheets. It's just single shot aside. This is green with white uh, or ivory looking flowers and stuff. Alright. This will be good for your your uh, journals and stuff. This newspaper writing or it looks like newspaper stamps and stuff all over it. Anyway, and then this one is done in gray with roses up here. It's writing. Alright, this has got a dark background, and look, there's a lady right there. Can you see her? And there's roses, there's a butterfly, there's another lady's face there, there's another butterfly. More roses, a lady's face, and lady's face, another lady's face, and one right there. You got butterflies on there. And this is like antique paper almost, but it's not really, but it's. And this is done with a dark back, I mean, a, a, I don't know what color. I think that's called a, a grayish cream color. And then uh, the leaves are green, and these flowers have a purple hue to them. They're not purple per se, but they look kind of like they're purple. They're purple to green or whatever. And this is pink background with uh, dark pink roses and green leaves. And this is strips. Uh, there's writing down there. And there's a the strip of flowers. There's a men's shoes. Uh, there's little bitty flowers. There's some more flowers. There's some more new, uh, writing papers. Uh, like newspaper strips. These are done in strips, so you can take them out and use them however you want to use them. There's three of those. Then there's this sheet. This is done in a dark, old, antique looking green uh, with pink flowers and uh, green leaves, and then there's printing in the background. Okay, now this one is a cream background. It's got newspaper print in here. And then it, I guess this is like a stamp or a faded thing. It's faded. But it's kind of a, it goes from a dark brown up here to a, a, a light color. And there's, this would be good for background. Ooh, look at that. Now, isn't that pretty? That's pink. It's a, a pale pink background. Uh, dark pink uh, flowers. There's writing in there. There's some silver right down here. I don't know if you can see it. Right here. Right there's some silver. And uh, uh, it's pretty. Now, this one is pink. This one don't quite look as pink. It looks like it's faded a little bit. Anyway, and then you got these... Uh, I guess you could use them for stamps. You could cut each individual one out and use it for stamps. Stamps. And you'd have plenty of them. Alright, now this one is like a French thing. You have a... Oops. You have a bird here. You have a clock here. Uh, background is done in a kind of a antique yellow. Uh, you have greens and pinks and browns all over. Uh, 
uh, free gift to women's world readers. And it's, uh, oh, look, you can bust and cut the bird. You can take out the flowers here. There's a lady right here. Um, it says champagne de la feminine chic. Teasdale Studios. I guess that's what that is. Anyway, and this is done in dark pink and it's got writing all in it. Oh, look at these flowers. These roses. They're all different colors. There's white with pink. There's pink with white. There's yellows. And there's flowers and then, I mean, leaves. And there's green leaves and a kind of a brownish color leaves. And it, it looks like they're all laying on uh, with a background of writing all through. That's beautiful. And there's some journaling pages, some newspapers or advertisements or whatever. And it's French. And this is. Oh, excuse me, my thing's coming off. Oh, uh, I guess just Well, it it came off. I'm sorry. Um. Anyway, the dark brown. It's dark brown. I don't know if that's dark brown or a dark purple. It looks like it could be a purple there. But anyway, they've got the light cream colored on the or dark cream on the back. Then this here golden brown here. And then this color, whatever that is. Okay. Then we have these stripes done in red, blue, and white. Then we have this writing with this is French, I guess. And then it's got shoes over here. You got butterflies. And you got this. French writing, I guess. Then you got this, uh, I want to say that's a bluish black color. It's probably a bluish color with uh, cream colored roses. Then you have some more advertisements and pictures and stuff. Um, you got a lady's face right there, one right there. Kind of stuff. Then you got your alphabet and typewriter form. Then you got your little cherries. Then you got some more advertisements. Ladies and there's corsets. And And this is uh, a golden brown. I don't know that you can tell it, but there's uh, uh, designs on it. Anyway, this is done in a cream background with pink writing and pink flowers and green leaves. And there's pink background with little brownish looking flowers. Uh, there's some more um, couture. So I guess that's, uh, yeah, it's French because it says Paris right there. So you got this old antique sewing machine. Uh, you got uh, theater programs, Domino, Dominion Theater Program, Silver Wings. It's done in red, white, and blue, antique look. Uh, here's green with uh, darker green flower, floral designs on it. Alright, this is done, these designs are done in green and brown. So 
some more advertisement and writing. There's a little lady right here. I don't know if you can see her or not. Yeah. And there are some stripes done in red and green. And this pretty that's done in cream background with blue flowers. Alright, there's some more journal. That's a page out of a journal. It's uh, Musica. There's a corset. There's a bird here. There's the lady right there. And it says journal up here. There's geometric designs done in braille. There's some more uh, French, I guess, with flowers. With roses in it. And here it's done in red with music sheets. Music at the back in the background. That'd be pretty. Now, this page is, uh, you got your wording and you got your brown background with the flowers. Here, right there, this is wording with uh, pink, dark pink. And then there's uh, your uh, mannequin. And your mannequin down there. And then you got your sewing stuff here, your, your spools, your tags, and your thread and stuff is down here. You know. Look at that. Now this one has got the green background with the white flowers and wording, and uh, wording is done in a darker green. More advertisements. Strawberries. Cards. Um, I think this is a purplish brown with writing on it. And then you got some more uh, French cutouts that you can use. You got green background with cream. You got a tan background with cream with florals in it. You got telephones, antique telephones. You got some more squares you can cut out. Different designs, strawberries, cherries. You got some more uh, French page with wording and uh, designs on it. Uh, this is gray with dark uh, designs on it. Or grayish green. Excuse me. Now this is done in all different colors. It's done in green, pink, cream colored, and gray, I believe is what it is. And it's just a desire. It's got wording on it. Ooh, this is pale pink. Or it's not quite pale pink, but it's pink, light pink. With gold wording on it. Here's some more of those squares. I think you've got about six pages of that. Here's some brown, uh, sort of like the calico fabric we used to have. But then on paper. And then here's some more pictures of some ladies. Come out of a journal, I think, with writing behind them. And here's your uh, blue and cream colored uh, the fabric they make the uh, pillows out of, 
And old Tommy pillows, cases, and pillows out of. And then here's some more pink flowers with some more writing behind it. Okay. And then the last one is this here green with creamy gold uh, designs. And that's it. Yeah. I think that's right. Yep, yeah, that's the last one. Okay, now this one, I think I said it already, but this one was $21.99 and 50% off. That would have been $11. So I got both of these for $23 with tax and everything at uh, Hobby Lobby. So that would have been the price of just this one here, this big one. I got this little one for free. So that's how much that was. So I thank you. And I thank you for putting up with my video. Y'all have a good day, a blessed day. And get outside and enjoy the sunshine. It's such a beautiful day. You know, go out and do something. Don't stay in the house. Okay. Y'all have a good day. Comment below if you enjoyed this video. Just let me know. Okay, bye-bye.